This is the NFL, and we are live from beautiful State of America Stadium in Chuckett, South Carolina. The Carolina Panthers are warming up their last week's kill on their sidelines barbecue pits as part of their pregame ritual. My pregame ritual is a lot different, Grim. It usually involves filling out accident reports and telling the paramedics what I may have ingested in the last 24 hours that could have caused projectile vomiting and projectile diarrhea or flowing down the staircase or an elevator shaft, depending on the stadium. That's a... Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The Galaxy Chaos face off against the Carolina Panzers. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If you're just waking up wondering who put that vice on your head and filled your mouth with vacuum cleaner, dirt, and cat litter, you're not alone. After all, it's Sunday, NFL game day. Hey, you look tired, Junior. And Bricks, you look like they just used your head in field goal practice. Been all night in the ER. We ate Chinese food last night. Food poisoning? I wish. I got the chopsticks lodged in my ears again. You know, they should have a warning on them things. <laughs> The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. <laughs> gonna hurt he may not be able to comprehend math oh and the late hit arrives right on time when it's your time to go it's your time second and three up the first down and it's first and ten oh ooh, and that's what they call the money shot he is running like an old guy looking for a bathroom first down First and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. I do. The guy should have fucking caught it. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. Put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Ouch! Anyone in the mood for steak tartare? First down! And the running game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. Gotta keep him guessing. And it's first and ten. Look out, that's an all-out attack on the kill. If he was still talking, he'd probably be saying, Psycho killer, kiss kiss say, what the fuck, the fuck, the fuck? The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Grim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. Uh, the funeral expenses, that is. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback calls a side blast dirty. And he's running like a moose. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. And 
and it's first and ten. Chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? And it's first and ten. <laughs> Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. And it's first and ten. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. First down and five. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. I'm going to say maybe three yards, but a tough three yards. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. And that's a pick. And now the quarterback. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. And it's first and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. They need a good return here to set up the offense. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. Second down and more than the QB would like. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. And Briggs, they just made up a whole lot of field in a hurry with that, with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwann Galaxy phone.
And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to hit. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And they're catching up. Joke, joke, no shot. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they had raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. Second down and five. And the NFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Well. <laughs> Down at five. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, Who's next? The Carolina Panthers blitz the opposition until there is no one left. They win by forfeit. The entire game was trench warfare. Both teams battling back and forth, bruised and battered, but in the end, there could be only one winner. There are winners in my book. I think that a feeder team should get a participation award because yeah, I tried really hard. Why don't you try real hard to shut the fuck up? Nice mouth. Why don't you try to lay off the Scots, Junior? Suck on it. Real nice. Let's go to the game's MVP. <laughs> Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.